Okay, everyone. Hey, um, I'm back with a, another extreme rant. Um, well, apparently today it has been confirmed that Andrew Garfield is um, the new Spider-Man. Fuck that. Seriously. Fuck that. Uh, no. He is not Spider-Man. Tobey Maguire is Spider-Man. Okay? I, I, I don't care what you say. I don't care if you... I didn't like the third one. He fucked it up. Eh, no. Tobey Maguire is Spider-Man. That guy is too freaking tall to be Spider-Man. That guy's like 6'4". Spider-Man is... Not, Peter Parker is not 6'4". Peter Parker's like freaking 5'9". Hello, have you seen his giraffe long neck? Jesus Christ. Ugh. Okay, no. A couple days ago, it was rumored that it was going to be Josh Hurtinson. Josh Hurtinson. You've seen him in like a, a vampire... Uh, vampire assistant... Uh, Journey to the Center of the Earth, uh, things like that. But um, he was rumored to be it. And today, Sony, hold on, Sony confirmed that it was them. Wait a minute. Sony doesn't have property rights to Spider-Man anymore. They gave that up when Marvel was bought out by Disney. So apparently, this one's not Sony's. The whole conversation, this is not Sony's... This is not Sony's movie. This is Disney. So, right now, really listen to me. It's still not confirmed. It's only confirmed by Sony. Disney can come back and say no. At any point in time, they can come back and literally tomorrow, in a few minutes, in a, couple, in a week or a month or whatever, and they can say no. And they can say no right as they begin shooting. Halfway into the movie. Literally. First they gotta do test shots with this guy. And if Disney likes it, then he, then he's then he's probably good. I just hope they release the test shots so we the fans can see it. But no, I don't like this guy. I've seen what he does. I've seen like a lot of stuff all over YouTube about him and everything. And he doesn't have the Peter Parker appeal. He doesn't have it. This is not. This is not Peter Parker Spider Man. No, I I don't see it there. The other rumor is that you know for this new one, it's called the Spectacular Spider Man. I kind of like that, but why couldn't we call it the Amazing Spider Man? Because that was the original name when it first came out. The Amazing Spider Man was his actual name in the comic books. But, eh, but. It's rumored that the lizard is supposed to be in it. Now I say, bring back the guy who played Doc Connors and give him a chance. Because Sam Raimi just literally like threw him in there to tease us all. So for that Sam Raimi, I say fuck you. But no, give him a chance. Br don't bring Gobby in right now. Bring somebody else in right now. Do what, do what no one did. Because originally, the first villain is the Joker. Uh-uh. He put Raz al Ghul and the Scarecrow in there for Batman Begins. And that was brilliant. That was brilliant. And then he put Joker in there. No, no. Do Take a hint from Nolan. Take a hint from the guy who's doing perfectly good right now in the comic book genre. Take a hint from him. Don't use Gobby right now. You somebody who hasn't been chosen and somebody you know can actually put it in there as a good storyline. I mean, I want to know what you guys think about this. Comment down below. Uh, tell me everything, what you think about this guy. I mean, if you think he's, if you think he's good, yeah, go ahead. Tell me, tell me I'm wrong. If you think he's bad, then agree with me. Go ahead. But I seriously don't, I seriously do not think that this guy can pull it off. I really think that Josh Hurston can pull it off. I think he can do it. I believe in that kid, and I'm still going to pull for him. So, Josh Hurston, as a Spider-Man fan, you have got my vote.